with another mukbang, you guys. Spider crab mukbang. This is called spider crab. Some of you may have seen me eat this in my ASMR video. Um, pardon my voice because I think I'm getting sick, you guys. All the sun and all the fun and all the pool time and yeah. um, not enough sleep, maybe. I don't know. Too much drinking. <clears throat> <laughs> Um, what? Anyways, <laughs> anyways, um, so yeah, we have two spider crab today. We went to the market. We were actually looking for king crab, but this is like the next best thing. Yeah. Um, show you guys closer. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> There's this one, and Aaron's crab is a little bit more intact. Mine is. Some of the legs. One of the legs is broken fallen off because I was a little rough with it when I because I cooked this one first and then I cooked that one after um, seafood sauce here um, this is not the usual seafood sauce I, I get with um, the uh, what's it called the, 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 the healthy boy brand this is the brand I found here in um, on the island I'm not really sure what the name of it is but anyway hopefully it's not too spicy it's still a Thai brand but hopefully, it is uh, yeah hopefully not um, too spicy. cucumber very simple today so yeah, let's let's give her a go. Let's give it a go. I um, don't even like remember the last time I've had spider crab. Spider I know it crab. is very, it's very painful. Yeah, it's very, it's very, very sharp. Yes. Um, have Ow. You, <laughs> have you ever eaten crab like this before? What? Like ones that you have to like tear open and cut open. Usually it's prepared for usually you. Usually it's usually someone prepares it for me. <laughs> usually, wow, you guys, this is no joke. I got poked a couple times. She got poked. Um, you Even trying to hold it up, she tried. She got poked. Yeah, there was a couple ouches in there. Yeah. Maybe you'll see it in the outtakes. <laughs> Maybe. Ow! 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 Yeah. The trick is. They're to sharper than the yeah. king crab, though. It is. Imagine running into these while you're like swimming. I'd be like, let me get you. <laughs> I gotta steam you right now. It's like when we pulled up to the ferry dock yeah. in uh, Koh Tao. Like, oh, are those sea urchins? <laughs> I swear I saw some sea urchin on the ground. <sighs> Not the ground, but on, on um, underneath like the, the rocks and stuff. Yeah. It, I swear it looked like sea urchin. It is. I'm pretty sure it is. Are you sure? Yeah. They're just not seaweed. No, I'm pretty sure they're sea urchin. <laughs> yeah. But we, we couldn't get a closer look because we were trying to catch the fairy. Yeah. Um, so I got mine out right there, you guys. Oh, I got mine out. You good? Yeah. Oh, okay. Try it. You, you try it first and see how... See, you try it first and see how spicy it is. <laughs> no, how, how you like it. Mmm. Let me go closer for you guys to see. Mm. I didn't want to slather it on there in case it's spicy. Oh. But it, it's a little bit spicy, but it's bit. not. So how's the sauce? Like, describe the sauce. Sweet, sour? Spicy. <laughs> <laughs> See, when something's mm. hot, that's pretty much all I can taste is. Mm. The trick is to, to eat, when you eat the seafood sauce, yeah. chase it with the cucumber. Oh. See how you like it. Mmm. Mmm, let's go. Mm. There's not much meat in these little legs, though, is there? To tell you the truth. Oh. I just really like crab, so I try and get, like, if it's worth it. Oh, actually, there's a good little bit in that second joint. Mmm. Mm hmm That's good. Spider crab. For such a, like, a non pleasant looking creature. <laughs> it's delicious, you mean? Yeah, they're pretty tasty. Okay, I'll try a little bit more this time. I'll chase it with the Yes. Chase it with it. the cucumber. Mmm. <laughs> Told you guys, if you guys have never tried cucumber with seafood, it's a must. Mm. At least once. It is. Ouch. Careful. It's almost like you need to like take all these little spikes off first. You can't, cause the meat is see like see the holes. It's like attached to the oh. meat. 
there's like when, when you actually pull out pull out you can use your scissors and cut it yeah when you pull the when you when you're able to pull the crab out can't you break it and pull it out like that too yeah try it and i feel like i'm gonna wreck it no oh wow what the beginner's Kay. luck how do you do that because all the times i've eaten crab you just I have to watch this joint and make sure it doesn't tear i could never like no no that joint there okay I, you have to turn it the other way so you can see it yeah it, it hurts because i can't let me see, let me see. Oh, oh, oh i got yeah. it got it got it got it and then just no i don't have is it is it gonna break i don't have it ouch come on come on come on come on come on no, no. it's stuck no you know why because the meat's right there but everything else oh oh maybe maybe oh do i have it oh come on, come you on. guys only on camera oh wow that's a big one that is a big one that's a big one. <laughs> oh my goodness you guys this is so good hopefully you can see the pool of uh, the view of the pool can't really see the ocean because it's pretty bright um we were trying to get like a front view but because it's so bright towards the camera we tend to be really dark so we try to kind of put half half try to balance it yeah mm. Mm -hmm. there's no mm -hmm. way I'd, I'd be as lucky with this end oh Whoa. so close Oh, oh, so close. You did it, though. Half. Mm. Last it's time I... so hard to do it with the king crab, too, though. Is it? Because on the bottom, like, where you pull out, yeah. it's, like, really um small. Mm -hmm. And the meat it's is such a thicker. It's such a fat leg. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so that's what I was thinking. To... Oh, I did want to get it all, too. Look, there was just a little bit of scurbins in there. Mm -hmm. Wow. Mmm. Such a weird looking little crab. What's its little back piece there? <laughs> That's the the private part to tell whether it's a girl or a boy. Oh really? <laughs> I shouldn't have looked under its dress then. <laughs> Come on. Mm. Ow. Ow. It does mm. hurt. Come on. Come on. This is glorious. Wow. Wow. Okay, now see, now I'm upping my seafood sauce braveness. <laughs> Especially with the cucumber, it's good. Mmm. Yummy. Mmm. On the last video, I know some of you guys said in the comments that you wanted to see a, our villa tour. I will give you guys a tour right after this mukbang, after Whoa. I wash my hands and everything. It's a pretty nice villa. It is. I love it here. Like, we love it here. It's so nice and cool. Too. Every time we think about, like, going home or back to Bangkok, we're like, hey, we should extend our stay. <laughs> 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 but we've been on, I think, I think it's, we, we've had enough sun time because, yeah. one, I'm getting sick. Two, I'm bright red. <laughs> yeah, my arm's pretty no, red. No, like I don't know if it'll show up on camera, but tell tell them about your sunburn story. <laughs> I was in the shade mm -hmm. all day. Mm -hmm. No, but a little history of like why you don't tan and you burn and stuff like that because I burn, I don't tan, yes. I go from white to red. To red. Uh, like a fair amount of other people that I've discussed it with. Like, uh -huh. And it's just, so I don't tan. I go from literally from white to red, no yeah. matter what. The only reason I tan is like when you're driving and you get like a driving arm mm -hmm. is because you get like 15 minutes of exposure here, 10 minutes there, like out in the sun here. And I was like, yesterday I was like, well, I'll just go out like a little bit here and there and I won't put on sunscreen and I literally went out oh that's a good one too oh wow Shh. 
in the shade all day, except I went down to take the garbage out once. Yeah. And that's the only time the sun actually touched my skin. But. And then by the end of the day, I was red. <laughs> But, but, here comes were, the but. No, but, but, because you were in the pool. No, yeah, you were in the pool and you're, and you're, you're still like exposed to the heat and you're Someone. swimming. No, and you're swimming and, you know what I mean? Exactly. Someone in the comments will explain <laughs> the reason for the sun's rays still burning you. <laughs> even in the shade. <laughs> I know they will. And thank you very much to that person who took the time to explain it. I don't understand it, yeah. but it's just the reflection of the water. I yeah, think that's why. Like kind of like kind of like when you're snowboarding, you get bad yes. burns yes. on a mountain. Because Be the sun ray on the snow. Yes. Even, it's it's oh, too late. Yeah, it's, it's crazy. bad. I've seen some of my friends have had no, like I've gotten like crazy burns. One of my friends her skin like Ooh. cracked like the moon mm. like it was like and she was like it was like it was the worst sunburn I've ever seen I was like wow yeah but I mean for someone who burns super easily should be super sun conscious and you I was like hey you're not gonna wear sunscreen he's like no I'm not gonna be in the sun it's fine I'm like okay I'm in the shade I'm like are you sure because I'm putting on sunscreen and I don't burn I'd be fine <laughs> I'd be fine sitting here all day but yeah but because you're fully clothed but no. this part, this part of you will still be burned. I have and been in the, the shade. Of your head. I've been in the shade before, mm. and I have not burnt. Mm. I got that one too. And I'm pretty sure it's because of the being. I, I was in the pool. the pool. That's what it was. But I was yeah. in the shade of the pool. So mm -hmm. there's the other side, and I think it reflects back. That's what it was. Because it's only like my front too. It's not even my back. So mm -hmm. I hate it. I know, and I feel so bad. It like ruins your whole day or two or For possibly him. three. Because yesterday I was like, listen, if you get burned because I told you to wear sunscreen, I don't want to hear about no, it. I don't want to hear about it. <laughs> and then when he was like all burned at the end of the day, I'm like, oh my God, I feel so bad. And I'm like, I took his hand. I'm like, if you feel like you need to complain and what's the, what's the word? <laughs> Be a baby. <laughs> Be a baby about <laughs> it. You can now because I feel really bad. And he's I like, wasn't saying anything all like, day. Thank you. Yeah, I was just sitting there <laughs> waiting. So just like, just you don't look so very bad. happy. Yeah. <laughs> don't touch. Don't touch. I know. I saw you. I saw you flinch there for a second because I was trying to touch your back. Mm, Anyways. Anyway. <laughs> But yeah, high yeah. five. High five to all the other really white people <laughs> who burn like crazy. Yeah. <laughs> it it uh, it happens at least once every time we go mm -hmm. somewhere. Last time tropical. we came to Thailand, uh -huh. we went out on the beach and the sun wasn't even up. It was five o'clock in the morning. We went on the ocean because the water's low. And the kids the, and Nico was there. That's uh -huh. before Emma was born. Yes. Yeah. And it literally was five a.m. because we were still jet lag, I think, at the yeah. time. And. And so we're like, oh, let's go take pictures in the ocean. Mm -hmm. It's okay, don't worry. The sun's not out. You won't mm -hmm. get burned. You're fine. Mm -hmm. Literally went there for not even 20 minutes. Maybe 20 minutes. Something uh, something around there. Yeah, probably 20 minutes, half an hour. Mm -hmm. yep. The next day, he was hurting. Burnt to a crisp. That was when I learned that no matter what, even if he's not out exposed 100% in the sun, he should always wear sunscreen. Because it was 5 o'clock in the morning, there was no sun. There was sun. no sun. It was cloudy. It was, there was like no just sun. peeking. It's like we almost had to have flashlights, I feel like. like so it's like fun. the moon burnt me. Yeah. No. Yeah. But I know. It always takes her once. I explain to things and I tell yeah, her, yeah, yeah, yeah. and then she sees it firsthand. We have many stories like that where we will not get into. But <laughs> Oh my god. And but, it always takes once. Mm -hmm. She doesn't and then once you see well, it, I mean, you you're know, just when like, you're, oh my when God. When you're getting to know someone, this is when we almost, uh, it's, got, it's almost like when we first met. We just never, we never been in or, like. Or like, or like a situation that has never like occurred. occurred. Yeah. And, and everyone's different. You don't things burn. Things happen. I was like, oh yeah, that's fine. Like, I think it's fine. But you're like, no, it's not. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, right. Yeah. <laughs> you know? And then it happens. We're like, oh, 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 I should have listened. <laughs> wow. That is real. Oh man, this one's coming apart so well. 
You're loving it, aren't you? I love it how easy it is. Ouch. There's nothing in these little front ones very much, is there? There is, but it's really hard to get to, so you kind of have to get a cracker. Mm -hmm. Um, You can dig into mine if you like. Here. Okay. I know there's not much Ow. meat in these little guys. Oh, I love it when it comes out like that. That's perfect. Come on. So sweet. The, the meat of this, because it's so fresh. Mm. Oh, yeah, I see. That's a toughie. Let's see if I can get it this way. Oh, it's so good. Ow, that is really sharp, though. Oh, no, it breaks right inside there. Mm. Oh, that's the claw? Yeah, the claw is like the hardest. Mm -hmm. Seafood always attract flies. But luckily, there's not much here. No, there's Just not. one random one flying around. Mm. Mm, yeah, it got torn to shreds. Mm. Still dip it, though. Mm. Okay. I'll steal one of yours. Ow! Yours is much sharper, it seems like. Ow! <laughs> Seriously, mm -hmm. mine didn't like, hurt at all. I was kind of like, I don't know, yeah. Ow! I want to open the the um, what do you call that? The shell. Mm. There you go. See what's inside. Probably nothing. Probably nothing. Because like in the king crab, you you can eat the head. Oh, with all the gills and stuff. Ow! Yours is like really sharp. <laughs> I feel bad for you now. Yeah, it's really sharp. I wasn't lying. See, it's just like the sunburn. You don't know until you try it. <laughs> until you see it first yeah. and you're like, oh, wow, she wasn't just like... Well, there's like meat in here. In the in the leg leg. In like the thigh. <laughs> no, I didn't come out with all one piece either. So next time when we have king crab, babe, mm -hmm. I want you to try and... Um, do that? Yeah. Because I can never do it. That'll be a, that'll probably be an epic fail, but I'll try. <laughs> oh, I wish you guys could try these. And I feel so bad for the, for for um, people who are allergic to seafood. Yeah, my cousin's allergic to seafood. Yeah. Poor so Richard. Good. Every time seafood comes out, he's like, "No, I'm allergic." <laughs> it's, like, <laughs> it's like someone's had a bad shellfish yeah. experience. Oh, and also I wanted to mention, I know some of you guys wanted Aaron to try different types of seafood other than like king crab. I'm allergic. So. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's just he prefers um, just king crab. Anything I else? crab. Yeah. Anything else? I have the thing, I have my likes and dislikes. Yes. I've already experienced a lot of seafood, so a lot of it. I prefer land-based animals, to tell yes. you the truth. And some fish, but I'm also... I don't like to use the word picky, but maybe selective. No, it's it's, it's not being. It's picky. just what it's you just, like. Yeah. It's the taste. Other other seafood tastes too seafoody to him. Yes. Or too fishy, I should just say. Just like cilantro. It's like I can't <laughs> handle cilantro. Come to Thailand and not liking cilantro or Mexico. This is a good piece of meat. Is it? Okay, let me just try and not cut my hand here on this. Oh. <laughs> you didn't even get it. It's one of the one of the big thigh pieces. Oh. How's that? Delicious. That's good. Yeah. So there's wow. lots of meat actually. Not on the legs but on the side. Come on. <laughs> Even the scissors don't cut the sucker sometimes. See, like look at that. Oh. This just brings back the time that we brought the king king crab to my grandpa's. Oh. People went nuts over that. That was like epic. Epic. Like and we didn't even have any. <laughs> no. And I didn't just, want any. No, we just buy it because we, yeah. we bought it for them. Yeah. Her mom kept trying to give it to me. And I was like, no, it's like, I've had it. Like, mm -hmm. we can get it. Like, mm -hmm. that was like, man, people were, everyone came for that. Oh, wow. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Yep. And then, and then, and then afterwards I was like, man, I should have bought two crabs. <laughs> yeah. Because I didn't know everyone was going to come. Because they, didn't, they, they some of them haven't have never even seen what a, a real. What did your What did your grandma say? King King crab looked like. 
Oh, she was like pointing to like the, like the 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 uh, the tentacles or something. The the crab like. Oh, the little. And like the feelers, eyes and like feelers, the yeah. feelers. And she's like, oh, let me let me inspect it. <laughs> she's like, I've never seen it like this before. Where's the eyes? She was saying. <laughs> <laughs> And then my grandpa, my grandpa, when it wasn't cooked, I let him look at it, and he's like, "Oh, that looks scary." <laughs> they are scary. They are pretty scary looking. And and when, because they're different color, right? When they're not cooked, so it looks more. I yeah, guess, they look like dangerous. dinosaurs. It's yeah. like It's like man. <laughs> mm. It's like what an old species. Mm. We also had a praying mantis fly in today mm. and land on the beach chair. It's like, man, what another weird looking animal. It's like harsh little alien. Mm -hmm. And it's funny because the, as soon as they notice you, like, they turn their head, but their, their hands and their feet are like up, they're ready to like box you. That's like... She's like, you can pick it up. I was like, no, no, I'm okay. <laughs> they look like aliens to me. They do. That's a good crab. Mm -hmm. My mouth is hot. <laughs> we can pick at it after this? Yeah. Oh. Cheers, Cheers to spider crab. Cheers to spider crab. <sighs> mm. So good. <laughs> so is it tour time now then for you? Oh yeah, that's true. Oh yeah, I was going to give you guys a tour. Mm -hmm. um, Clean up and tour? Yeah. Oh, I think I should clean up first. Okay, and then, I think so. Because I don't want any flies no. coming here. Or ants. Or ants. Or anything else. Yeah. <laughs> no, there's not that much ants here, but anyways, just to be safe. And so, you guys, are you ready for the villa tour? First of all, look at this view. Like, look at this view. We've got a whole view of the ocean. The ocean view. On top of that, you guys, look at our pizza floating. <laughs> <laughs> And it's an uh, infinity pool. The best pool you can have. Um, but yeah, so so this is like the entrance right here. This is where the door is to the entrance. <laughs> Babe, be careful. Don't fall. So then now we turn this way. We This this whole thing is actually a three bedroom um, villa. So this is a bedroom. This is a bedroom. So the curtain is closed because, you know, <laughs> it's pretty messy. Um, so this is the second bedroom. This is what, it, uh, what, what all the three bedrooms look like. Just the bed with everything in there and the bathroom is like, bathroom and shower is behind this wall right here. Mm -hmm. And this is the living room area. We barely hang out here because we hang out in the pool and, and you know, we, we mainly hang out in the pool. So we don't really use that area anyways. This is going to be like the shortest tour ever. <laughs> and this is the third bedroom, which is pretty messy. So I'm not going to show you guys. Um, that's that one. And then an open concept kitchen. I love it. Because when you're cooking, your kitchen doesn't really like soak up all the smells and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, look at all the windows. And then you walk over here. Ocean view and the pool. So there you have it, you guys. Hopefully you enjoy this quick mini villa tour. It's not that big, so <laughs> that's all there is to it. Um, but anyways, you guys, thank you so much for watching. We'll see you guys next time. Mwah. Bye. Bye-bye.